Raven. Hello and welcome to the Prague pre hackathon 2017. Uh, it's the first day of our event here in the Wikimedia Czech Republic's office and for the for the whole pre hackathon we'll be working on the Wikimedia Commons mobile app. I'm interested in free software uh, for like three years and I was trying to contribute but uh, you know every project is very huge and it's hard to contribute. Um, I, my first contribution was to Wikipedia Android application and the community was very welcome, like they helped me a lot and I made some small bug fixes, very small. I tried to search what other project you have, like Wikipedia have and what, what, what else I can do. And I found Commons application on Outreachy Planet blogs page um, in the planet all Outreachy students share their experience about Outreachy and I saw Josephine's blog post so I uh, found the GitHub page of the application and I started contributing. My first contribution was adding light temp to the app. It was only dark and I did, added the light temp. Um, so I saw the pre-hackathon email so I decided to come. I was planning to go to the hackathon anyway so I am here right now. Uh, actually, I think we are a good team currently. We <laughs> met each other like three days, but I think it's a good team. Hello from the Wikimedia pre hackathon in Prague 2017. <laughs> we are the participants of the first pre hackathon taking place in Prague ever and the first pre hackathon in the history of the Wikimedia movement actually. Um, and we concentrated on the improvement of the Wikimedia Commons Androids app and that's what my friend Josephine is here to yeah. introduce. Yes, hello. Um, so the Wikimedia Commons Android app is um, an app that lets you upload pictures um, directly from your phone to Commons. Um, and we have this little um, nearby places feature that um, lets you see the places around you that are lacking in photos. Um, so as you can see, we are at the office of uh, Wikimedia Czech Republic, um, which is a voluntary association. So the feature that we've been working on um, for the pre-hackathon is uh, a map of um, these places. Uh -huh. So if you zoom in, you'll see um, all of the pictures around Prague, which is where we are, that um, could do with some photos. So we're hoping that um, people will feel inspired to take a nice little walk around their neighborhood and um, pick up, um, upload pictures for some of these places. So for example, if you click on one of these, it will bring you to um, a short description of the point and from there on you can um, get directions to um, where the lo location of the place is according to your map map. Uh, yeah. um, you, as you can see, there's a little read article option here. Um, but for the time being, it's a bit of a roulette. <laughs> sometimes you go to Wikidata, and um, sometimes you go to Wikipedia, and sometimes even to comments. So <laughs> that's something that we're trying to fix at the moment. The main purpose of um, this feature, the way it currently is, is to um, see the places that need photos. But um, in the future, it, it would probably be nice to be able to see um, the pictures that have been uploaded of uh, places near you, just to get a feel of you know, a browsing experience to see what other people have uploaded around your area. I think it would be pretty interesting. Um, so currently, um, Adam is working on um, enabling two-factor authentication, which is, I think, a feature that a lot of power users would want. And um, Dinu is working on um, 
trying to um, mm -hmm. well you see some people are having trouble uh, assessing the app because um, the front screen the main screen the way it currently is takes up a lot of memory um, loading all of the pictures that they have in their that they have um, submitted before so um, Dino is trying to um, limit that to um, so that anyone with any phone regardless of what the phone specifications are can access our app Oh uh, yeah, I think the weekend has gone really great. Um, I'm, I'm excited about the results yeah, that we definitely. that we made here and the the achievements of all the people that participated on this event. And uh, but taking into account that there are several more days to go, and we will also have a lot of time during the Wik Wikimedia Hackathon in Vienna. I think we are gonna make a really significant change to the Commons app as it is. Yeah, everyone has been really amazing. So yeah, we're pretty confident that we'll have lots of improvements for you guys soon. Yes, on to Vienna. <laughs>